Hello everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we'll discuss custom fonts and how you can add them to your Shopify store. Shopify has a typography section where you can choose fonts, but it only offers six options. If you want to use Google Fonts or other custom fonts, you'll need to take additional steps. I'll guide you through the process of adding custom fonts. I've created a setting with a drop-down menu that includes four fonts, three of which I've downloaded from Google Fonts. You can follow the same method to add any font you like to your store. You can customize this further by adding as many fonts as you want, whether it's four or 40, the choice is yours. I'll show you step-by-step step how to do this, so be sure to watch the video till the end. Let's get started. Let's move ahead and navigate to the admin panel. Once on your admin page, locate the three dots and click on them to access the code editor. In the code editor, you need to search for two files, theme.liquid and settings underscore schema.json. Once you find these files, paste the provided code into them. Start by pasting the schema code under line 9 in settings underscore Save it, and then move to theme.liquid. Locate the end of the section, where the tag begins, and paste another block of code below line 307. And save your changes after pasting. Next, go to the Customize Theme section from the admin. In the Customization menu, Navigate to Theme Settings, and you'll find an option for Font Settings at the top. Click on it, and a drop-down will appear with four fonts already added. If you want to add a custom font, here's how you can do it. If you want to use Google Font, then search Google Fonts on your browser. Now download the font according to your choice. Like I am downloading this font, click on Download and download it. After downloading, if your font file is a zip file, then unzip it first. You have to check its property first. Click on the property. As you click on the property, you will see the properties. Look here for the type of file. This is a TTF file. First, you have to convert the TTF file into a WOFF file. So how can we convert the TTF file to a WOFF file? To do this, go to your browser and search Cloud Convert. You will see the converter here. Select TTF to WOFF Convert. You have to keep this in mind that you should always keep your font in WOFF format. You have to select the file which you want to convert. Now click on Convert. After converting, download the file. You have to come to your Shopify admin. Now you have to come to your content. Now you have to click on the content here. You get a file option. Click on it. Now you have to upload the downloaded font here. You can find WOFF written here. After uploading, go back to your code editor. Now you have to come to the editor. Keep one thing in mind. Whatever font you uploaded, you need to copy its URL from here. After that, you have to come here. Now you have to duplicate this code. You can give the font family name according to you. I keep the name GR Trading. Now paste the URL of your font. That's it. Now you have to save. Now you have to copy this name. Go to settings underscore schema.json. Here is the option for value. You can also duplicate the value from here. Now duplicate it. Now change the value and label by the name which you have kept in your font family. And save it here. Now go back to your customization. And if you come back to the drop-down, you will get another option by the name of GR Trading. Now click on this and select. 
so you can see it's working and fonts are changed. By using this method, you can add multiple fonts. For its Hindi video, you click on I button and watch from there, and I have also given the link in description. So this was today's video. That's all for today. If you like it, then like the video, comment, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.